some people didn't think you'd see me again or for a while but i am back and yes i'm growing something i need to shave yes but it's growing it's getting there but you're wondering what are we here for well you'll just find out in just as these mr beast i am back for him so for those of you who should know as mr beast is one of the biggest youtubers out there and honestly, it's very popular known uh, for him. Basically, uh, he opened up a restaurant, or not really, uh, no, yeah, opened up a restaurant uh, for a video to basically make their style of burgers, I think it is. So it's like inspired from what they actually have uh, personally, which is kind of a cool idea. And honestly, uh, it was mostly all in the U US, not UK, sorry, but some shops or some places were doing mr beast here as well only in some certain locations but over time it came all the way over every other place and now there is one kind of just local to where i live uh chillwell and honestly i'm happy to try this so, let's so i have it. ordered the beast style burger and the beast style fries now as i open them up oh it's a bit greasy holy shit <laughs> So, oh my god, looks like a hellish nightmare, but that is loaded, as you can see here, not too bad, they are loaded, uh, looks like caramelised onions with uh, pickles and kringle cut fries with, by the looks of things, it's tomato, ketchup, mustard and mayo with that i think so i'll be back in just a second to get the so i have burger. ordered the beast style burger and the beast style fries now as i open them up oh it's a bit greasy holy shit <laughs> so oh my god looks like a hellish nightmare but that is loaded as you can see here not too bad they are loaded uh, looks like caramelised onions with uh, pickles and kringle cut fries with, by the looks of things, it's tomato, ketchup, mustard and mayo with that, I think. So, I'll be back in just a second to get the beef. Sorry, put it out there. But, that isn't half bad. That is not half bad for... Uh, a burger. I'll just use that for a wipe real quick. I don't have any tissues to mind. No, I don't, unfortunately. But, so yeah, the burger isn't too bad. So, let's get into the fries. Well, they're loaded with sauce. It's just loaded. There's all pickles. Not too bad. Not not too bad. To be honest. So, in hmm, uh, the fries are nice and crispy a little bit, but I feel like the fries, the loaded fries, are like too loaded. Like they've just got a load, just crammed in. You know, condiments. You know, they've crammed in a load of onions, pickles. You know, and all the sauces. So. You know, you're not, you can't really, literally, you can't even see the fries. On, because I've made a little dent, you can see the fries, but you can't see them. <laughs> like, the, like the, it's not even, you got fries there. But I'm going to uh, finish this off, and I will be back and come out with the rest of the review. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed, I'll be back in a moment. So now we're going to review the Mr. Beast Burger. So, uh, the fries were loaded, uh, really, really loaded. Uh, to my liking, I feel like it was just crammed in. Uh, like I said, there was just a load of sauces. Uh, I think it was like mayo, mustard, and ketchup. And then I think it was, uh, yeah, it was uh, pickles and caramelized onions, which isn't too bad. But I feel like the, uh, they overly sauced it up a lot. I feel like they oversourced it. They oversourced it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, to be honest, it wasn't too bad. Uh, I've got a bit left over. Uh, made me a bit full. But 
The flavour was oh, actually alright. It was a bit overpowering on some bites, so I got like a bit loaded with sauce and onions with a bit of pickles. And then the fries. And honestly, I I tasted more the sauces than I did anything else. So just be warned on that uh, if you were to put it like seasons, because there are, I think, two options for the... If you do buy the B-style fries, they will be unseasoned or seasoned. Uh, so, rating on the fries, I'll give them around a 2 out of, not 2, Jesus, 6 out of 10, 6 out of 10, uh, maybe 7, if maybe they just put a little less sauce in there and, you know, just kind of balance it out. Uh, with the with the Beast Burger itself, it was a smash uh, burger, uh, double smash burger, it wasn't too bad actually, it was nice and juicy, had a bit of crispy parts as well, which I really like in a smash burger. The burger bun was soft, uh, I wish it was maybe a bit toasted, but that's personal preferences. Uh, but uh, it wasn't too bad, it wasn't, It was. I liked it, it's, it was one of the better burgers I've had. From let's just say like McDonald's or even Burger, well, I'd even compare it to Burger King, maybe a little bit better because... The burger was really, it was really nice. You know, you could actually taste it really good. It was nice, just seasoned at, at least decently well. And uh, the sauces were pretty nice on it. Like I said, I think it was only ketchup and mustard. So it wasn't too bad. But overall, the burger was the best, which is good. So I'm I, like, if I would rate the burger, it'd be around for me 7.5 to maybe 8 out of 10. Uh, but the pricing, honestly, the pricing of Mr. Beast Burger, hopefully, maybe they might tone the price down just a tad little bit because it was like eight pounds for a burger, and that's like a five guys type of pricing, and uh, not a lot of people are gonna do that. You do get the Beast style combo though. I think the almost basically the only combo you get right now, so there isn't any uh. Like any other like old chicken sandwiches or anything like that at the moment. I th oh, I don't know if there is, but maybe in some other areas there is, but in some there isn't. But overall, so the pricing it, it it's on the higher end. So just just be warned on that, uh, just in case because uh, yeah, it, it is pretty pricey. I know it's only like 12 quid and that's not a lot to some, but it is for some, so yeah, I mean, you can go to a McDonald's and get like a Big Mac meal for like 6, uh, almost like 6.30, you know, 6.30, it's not too expensive, so, you know, you could basically get two meals out of McDonald's and you could actually, and then you could only get one meal out of uh, Mr. Beast, so just, just be, uh, just, just know that. But overall, uh, the pricing, the food quality, and even even the branding, as you can see here, the branding isn't too bad actually. You know, it's it's there, it's, it's colourful, bright, you know, catches your eye, and it's like, oh, I might want to go back for some more. But aside from that, the burger, fries, pricing, overall, Mr. Beast Burger is pretty good. I would recommend it to try once at least, maybe. And then, like I say, if you guys want to try it more often, that's up to you. But yeah, I'd say give it a try if it's in your local area or, you know, it's in your area. Uh, so I'm going to rate Mr. Beast as a whole, Mr. Beast Burger, around a 6 to 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10, yes. But we'll, 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 go, we'll go 7 out of 10. Uh, but, like, I feel like the pricing will drop my score down a little bit to around 6 out of 10. Because, like I say, it's a bit on the pricey. But... I keep on repeating myself, but aside from that, Mr. Beast Burger is really, really good. So I would recommend it, I'd give it a try. And uh, yeah, aside from that, thank you guys almost. Oh. <laughs> thank you guys so much all for watching. I have been Owen from Team Wrestling Nerds. It's been a while, it's been a while, so I'm a bit rusty. It's taken me a few tries to get this out, but. Yeah, thank you guys all so much for watching, and hopefully I get to catch you guys in more videos coming soon, maybe. Not too sure. We'll see. Bye-bye.